Lebanese security forces have been patrolling the streets of Tripoli for a second consecutive day in an attempt to put an end to months of violence that has spilled over from neighboring Syria. At least 27 people have been killed in the city in clashes over the past three weeks between Sunni Muslims and members of the Alawites, a Shia Islam offshoot. This man says that people are fed up with the fighting and shelling. They don't want to see another house attacked or any family be displaced from their home because they're in a bad financial situation. He adds that he doesn't want his people to face the same problems that Syrians are dealing with. Despite the recent clashes, residents of neighbouring Alawite and Sunni districts have expressed unity. This man from the mainly Alawite Jabal Mosin district said the area had been under siege. They, along with those in the mainly Sunni Bab Tabane district, were one family. The United Nations Refugee Agency has said that the millionth Syrian refugee is expected to register in Lebanon on Thursday, a major strain on the country of an estimated 4.5 million residents. The mounting costs have been a major challenge for the new government, with Syrians seeking housing, food and health care.